Hi, my name is Colleen Bingham Solis, and I'm the founder at Herb Nerd. I was born and raised in California. I've never lived anywhere else outside of California. I, I do consider myself a California girl. <laughs> Even though I've moved up from Southern California to Northern California where it's a little more green, I didn't discover herbalism until after I graduated from college. You know, I was getting like infused with it sub subliminally by different things that I was doing throughout my life. I was out in Vermont and I was so obsessed with natural skincare. I was going to every single local natural food store and farmer's market and I was like searching the shelves for things that were made right there in Montpelier, Vermont. Like, oh my God, loving everything. My friend saw how like obsessive I was with this skincare and she looked at me and was like, you know, you can make that stuff. And I was like, what? She's like, it's total blindsiding. She's like, yeah, I mean, obviously I'd seen the one at the farmer's market make it, but she's like, yeah, you, there's this woman, her name's Rosemary Gladstar. She has this book, I think. It's like a little beauty book on how to make your own skincare products. And that was a pivotal moment for me in my life. I went home from that trip. I got that book. I started making those recipes. I signed up for my first herbal course with Jane Bothwell up in Humboldt County. And that was it. Like my life completely changed. And so much of that is this piece about the environment and how I am finally able to connect in to these plants and the earth in a visceral way where I can, where I can feel like I'm tending to the earth, that I'm educate, educating people about how to take care of the planet, and that I'm showing people how to reconnect to the natural world and how it's just right there. It's right outside your door and it's so accessible. And for people like me who have that brain that's always going and I need to always be moving, not only is it right outside my door, but I can go out there and I can harvest some of it respectfully and bring it back into my home and totally bridge that gap. There's no longer a divide at that point. You are, you are fully engaged and you've brought it into your home and you're making it into medicine and you're using it to heal yourself and your family and all of your friends and then they're inspired by it. That's why I love teaching it and that's why I want to put myself out there in this way is because it changed my life so much and I really want it to do that for other people as well. So it's this combining plant medicine, taking plants and putting them into products. And that's kind of where Herb Nerd was born, was, okay, I want to channel my personality into this name. I am in fact a nerd. I have always been. I've never really tried that hard to be cool. And I, and I, and I love talking about plants. Herbalism is a topic where people are drawn to it. I don't know if it's the energy of the planet or Mother Gaia that's like reminding people that this information is out there or what, but you know, the community that's built around herbalism is very attractive and it's very magnetic. I really hope that people are thriving with this information, that they can take it and actually utilize it. I believe also that the, the green beauty movement and the herbal beauty movement and the industry, I mean, that's the direction that the beauty industry is going right now. Through the act of being a green beauty formulator, you are doing an act of environmentalism, if you do it right. There are so many companies out there that aren't doing it right, that aren't taking the steps towards sustainability, they aren't paying close enough attention to the herbs that they're choosing to use in their formulas and whether or not they are at risk of being over harvested. I definitely want to relay that information to my students of like, check yourself, Try not to just jump into something because it sounds amazing. Ask questions. Although you'll go on my website now and you'll see a lot of coming soon. I promise you I'm working hard on the content and it's, it's on its way and I'm so excited for the many different paths that I can take this.